stick your indexing tools directly under your row units and if you have a 12 row machine you need 24 of these if you have a six row machine you need 12 okay because you need to do them all at the same time so you get them under make sure that they don't hit the opening disc okay then finish lowering your your row units to the ground and I ask that you do it gently because you're going to actually be setting your opening disc on the floor and it's going to be holding up the row unit. Okay, is everybody with me so far, the operation? What's the first step you do? Get your patented two by fours. That is smart. Good man. Okay. What's the second step? Take it to set it to as deep as you can. And then the third step is lower it gently to the floor or you'll make your my competitive dealer happy in the parts department. So, so bring it down slowly. Now I got the wheels on it. Take your handle and move it all the way forward as far as you can. Okay, in this particular case. I'm going to have to set it in, okay, I got it, I got it in this situation. I've got one, two, three, four, five. I'm in five, four, okay? You take each row unit and do it. If you have a six, six row planner, you'll probably be finding one to two of your rows at a different depth setting. If you have a 12 row, it's probably three to four. So what happens is you go down each one. This is 5-4. The next row is 5-4. The next row is 4-4. Four, four. Next row is 6-5. Okay? Then you mark those rows and identify them so when you go to the field and you get out, you dig and say, hey, that's the right depth. I've got the right moisture and temperature. That's where I want it. You know that when you get to those rows, you either set it a quarter inch shallower or a quarter inch deeper than the rest of the rows. So that at least you're starting out with all your row units planting the same depth, okay? And we know temperature-wise what that will do for you and moisture-wise that can make a difference, okay? And so keep that in mind. If you do that, your emergence will improve. They'll be more uniform, okay? So that's, take the time to do it, please. You see where pricing's going on your, 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 your commodities? Your input costs aren't going down, right? So the reality is you've got to make it up in improving the efficiency of what you do, and that is increasing your yields. Any quick questions?